Welcome back. There is a new tool in the fight against the opioid crisis in South Jersey. It's a pill bottle with a twist. NBC 10 Siobhan McGurl shows us how the county hopes a little bottle will help save lives. On the road to recovery in Burlington County, Hello again. people can find help right in the street. We're ready to meet people where they're at. A coordinated effort bringing resources directly to those struggling with addiction. And now the county has a new tool to offer. So it's basically a locked combination pill bottle. So you can put your medication in it and then close it and then twist. And it's, it's very secure. Using opioid settlement funds, Burlington County bought these locking pill bottles. Each one has a unique combination. The goal? To keep opioids that are legally prescribed to an individual safe with that individual. More than 2.2 million opioid prescriptions were written in Burlington County between 2015 and 2022. It is a large number. And those prescriptions don't always stay in the right hands. Rich Alexander has been in recovery for more than 30 years. He now works as a recovery coach. When people can't get pills anymore, they start stealing others and going into other people's cabinets. And then the people who are being stolen from, they just don't know. The county will stock the pill bottles here on Hope One. It's a mobile outreach unit, and they say a game changer in the fight against substance abuse. To reduce the stigma of substance use disorder uh, and mental illness, um, we do a lot of good things. The pill bottles are a piece to the larger puzzle, but they hope the lock will be key to preventing more overdoses. Potentially life-saving. In Palmyra, Siobhan McGraw, NBC 10 News.